is there a psychiatrist in the house? I think I'm losing contact with reality. It started last night whenever I was reading about some of the Heaven's Gate uh, cult, and one of them, that's one of the survivors, was saying that uh, some of the, one of his dead friends visit him, visits him in the form of a bird and talks to him. And I went to bed with that on my mind, and I had this dream last night, and I woke up this morning, and I don't know whether, uh, at least I think it's a dream, I, I don't know whether it was a dream or reality. And I, and I came, sat down at the breakfast table, was reading the newspaper, drinking my coffee, just still going through the normal routine when I, I started to hear voices. Good morning. Good morning. I finally, uh, I looked around there in the bowl of fruit was uh, my grapefruit was talking to me. And I, I, I went ahead and had a conversation with my grapefruit for a moment, and as best I could tell, it was Marilyn Monroe. And I talked to my grapefruit for a little while, and, and we talked about the stock market. And my grapefruit, in, inhabited by Marilyn Monroe, began to sing a love song to me. Well, I was flattered by that. I want to be loved by you, just you, nobody else but you. You know how you do strange things in dreams, but at the same time, in the dream, it may, it may seem to have a kind of rationale to it. I, I reached over and, and uh, because I was thinking about Marilyn and you've seen that commercial where they test the uh, holodent on the cup and they hold it up and to see if uh, to show the strength of holding your false teeth in your mouth and so I, I was suddenly while she was saying it went into that demonstration of, of holding my cup up there and testing the polydent so I was going to put my dentures in, put my dentures in and I took a look at them in the mirror and I wish I'd soaked them a little longer, they look so bad and then I, for some, to test the strength of the, the denture cream I bit into an apple, left my dentures in the apple, but I still, I wanted to I had this strange, uh, overwhelming urge to kiss Marilyn Monroe. I wanted to kiss her because I, I know it looked would look kind of foolish for an old guy like me trying to kiss Marilyn Monroe, but I don't think it looked much worse than seeing Woody Allen kissing some young girl on screen. So I. Even though I lost my dentures, I went at Marilyn with just my bare gums. I was going to give her a kiss right on the smacker. And when I reached her and grabbed her and kissed her, she was yelling, oh no, oh no. She, I felt like it's some kind of date rape, but I don't know if you can get a guy a date rape for kissing, a, I guess it's a grapefruit because as soon as I grabbed her and kissed her, there was nothing, there was no face on her anymore. It was nothing but a grapefruit all along. I guess it was a grapefruit, just my imagination. She was always a little fuzzy. I never could quite see her too well, but I guess it was a grapefruit. And, and then I woke up and I, the problem was I woke up and there was my dentures over there in the glass. They were still there. There was lumps in the bed, and when I threw them out, it was a couple of grapefruit. So now I'm completely lost. I don't know whether it was, I don't know whether it was a dream or reality. Am I, have I fallen in love with the grapefruit? If there's a psychiatrist that could help me, I'd appreciate it.
I wanna be loved by you.